In this video, I will show you how to install MinGWW64 using the compressed file. So let's go to the navigator and here let's type MinGWW64. So let's find the source forge link, which is this one. So I will click on this. And in this page, I will not click on download because it will download the source code for us. And this is not what I want. So I will click on files. Then I will scroll down and here I have the installer, but also I have different zip files or compressed files. So I have different compressed files for the different versions of MinG WW64. Also, I have a version for 64 bit systems and for 32 bit systems. So since I am using the 64 bit system, I will choose one of these four. So I will select POSIX and C. So I will select this link. Now I can save this file on my computer, but I have already downloaded it. So I will cancel this download and I will use the compressed file that I have already downloaded, which is this one. So I will open it. And as you can see inside it, we have this folder. So I need just to unzip it. So I need to extract it and I will just extract it on the C drive. So I will remove all of this part from the path and I will click on OK. Now let's go to the location where we extracted this MinGWW64 and it is on the C drive into this folder. And into this folder we have this binary folder that we need to add to the system environment variables. So I need to copy this and I need to add it to the system environment variables. So in this window I have to click on advanced system settings and in this window I have to click on environment variables. Then I have to find the path variable which is this one and I need to modify it. So at the beginning of this field I will just paste the value that I copied and also I need to add semicolon as the separator between the different values. Now let's click on OK, OK, OK again and let's close this window. Now let's try to use this MinGWW64 to compile a C++ file. So I have already created this folder and inside this folder I have this C++ file. So this is a simple code that I can compile using this command. So I will just copy it. And also we need to open the uh, command prompt from this uh, folder. So in this window, I have just to paste the command that I copied. And also I can execute this command. As you can see, this binary folder has been created. It is an executable file that I can execute like this. And as you can see, this is the output. However, MinGWW64 that I installed does not contain the make tool. So if I add this make file, I cannot create, I cannot build this C++ file using this make file and the make tool. So if I go back to this command prompt and if I type make, I will have this error which says that make is not available on my system. So here, as you can see, make is not recognized because I did not install it. And this make tool is available as part of one of these two distributions, either MCS2 or Sigwin. So in the next videos, I will show you how to install MCS2 and Sigwin together with Minji WW64. Thank you very much for watching and please subscribe to the channel.